So I got here the one wheel point eight limited edition. The greatest news is that the one wheel Pint X is gonna fit perfectly in IKEA bag so I get to carry it here quite comfortably. This is how we are shooting today in Star 361X2 and the Road Wireless Go 2. I am Guide Angelo and I welcome you to the tech log. Even if I used to ride more electric skateboards, I can't transfer this experience at once on the one wheel. Let's try to find out why. In the beginning, you have to remember all the time that you don't have a remote. You're gonna get used to it quickly, but for the very first minutes, it's a little bit strange. And it's better if you practice to hold your balance on the one wheel without turning it on, without motor. Because if you manage to do this, as I've practiced in the studio, then it's gonna be easier on the first try. As you're gonna be able to control the speed and the brakes much easier. And that's what I've done at the very first ride. Just a few hundred meters on one direction, turning around and changing direction, just to get a feel for the whole process. And in about 10 minutes, I was ready, I thought at least. So, I grabbed the camera and let's hit the road, baby. Here we go, riding the one wheel Pint X. It's such a nice feeling, even for the very first time. I'm gonna be honest with you, I didn't have enough patience to get a nice weather and optimal conditions for the very first ride with the one wheel. As you can see, the weather was cold and rainy and the street was pretty dirty. With a kind of dirty slime that you can slide on it, but even like this, I had a lot of trust that the one wheel will bring me safely. Anyway, I got some wobbling here and the beauty of one wheel is that you can outrun it if you're not quicker than 20 or 25 km per hour. And you take care, like a year. Bop, 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 bop. Yes, everything fine. I was a little bit scared though that I could fall, I could fall badly, but this didn't stop me to try again. And the more you try, the better will be the feeling of it. And at one point, you're gonna feel like you are in the control and everything is gonna be fine. So, my first ride went well without big adventures. So I do really hope it has a kind of waterproofing because uh, you're gonna ride it in different terrains and the contact with the water is gonna be inevitable. And that's why I'm cleaning it with a hose. It's not a high pressure one, it's just a normal hose, but it helped me to get the uh, dirt out like pretty quick and uh, make it shiny again. This is also the reason I think the one wheel is not complete without a fender and they should sell it with one. It doesn't have to be the expensive carbon fiber fender that looks sick and it's gonna be sturdy that the plastic one but even a standard plastic fender will keep you away from the dirt and will keep your feet safe. And that's why we're gonna mount the carbon fiber fender in the next video. So stay tuned for it. And did I saw it right? Did you just subscribe? Oh, it's not gonna be for long. I'll go, I'll go. Leave a like. See you in the next one. Bye bye and cheers.